did you know that at least 50% of all Americans make New Year's resolutions? Well, that sounds reasonable, but I bet you didn't know that according to research, 88% of those people fail. Stay tuned to learn my three super secrets of for keeping your resolutions. Welcome to this episode of Organized by Design, small tips that lead to big productivity gains with professional organizer, Leslie Podolsky. Everybody is excited to start the new year with fresh ideas and resolutions, but many times we lose steam by February. Well, today I'm going to help you keep on track all year long with my three super secrets for keeping your resolutions. Number one, make your resolutions specific and attainable. Not only do you need to know what your resolutions are, you need to know how you will accomplish them. Start by breaking down your goals into small steps of action that you can easily manage so that you don't get overwhelmed and do nothing. For example, if your resolution is to conquer your email backlog, then your first small step could be to choose 10 emails to delete. Your next small step might be to unsubscribe to 10 newsletters or blogs that you never read. These tasks take less than five minutes and you can do them every day. The idea is to create tiny habits that will become part of your normal routine. Then you will do them without even thinking about it. These tasks will keep you moving forward to your ultimate goal. Number two, hold yourself accountable for reaching your goals. You can do this in a few ways. First, you can write down your goals. There's something about having them in black and white that makes you more able to accomplish them. You can even post your list in a place where you'll see them every day. Next, tell your colleagues and friends about your resolutions. The more people who know about them, the bigger your support system and cheering section. Also, many people enlist an accountability partner. This is a person with whom you communicate regularly about your goals and resolutions. I have definitely found that sometimes it is easier to keep a promise to someone else rather than yourself. Say you tell your accountability partner that you will follow up on a particular lead before your next meeting. You will have them to answer to if you don't do it. Number three, give yourself rewards and do it often. Yes, you deserve it. Positive feedback significantly increases your chance for success. Start by recognizing your small steps or mini goals. For instance, if your resolution is to organize your desk and you have just cleaned out one drawer, then it's time for a reward. Pat yourself on the back and treat yourself to that cup of fancy coffee that you love. This will be great motivation to continue the process. Take small steps until you are done. And finally, laugh at minor setbacks and keep a can-do attitude. Remember, it's always better to get back on track than to give up. Throughout my shows, I will be giving you small organizational tips for big productivity gains. I will even give you a challenge should you choose to accept it. I will give you two small action items you can do before my next episode. Today, I will ask you to go to my website at organizedbydesignohio.com and download my free two of my free resolution worksheets. Fill one out with a business resolution and one with a personal resolution. Then put them up somewhere where you will see them every day. You will be well on your way to a successful year. Thanks and see you next time. We hope you gain valuable tips in this episode of Organized by Design with Leslie Podolsky. For more great information, visit her website at organizedbydesignohio.com. Also browse the other shows found right here at Toledo Biz TV Shows.